These um, are the first things I got from iMats. I thought it would be really good to get two different sets. Um, I'll be giving these away individually. Um, but these are some really good blushes from Ben Nye. And Ben Nye is a really underrated company because they've got really good products. Um, the problem is that they can look quite expensive. Um, it's not once you actually do the maths and you figure out how good they are and how long they'll last and also how big the pans are. But I thought that this would be a really good set to give away. So I got the blush set. Um, and then this one is the Essentials Eyeshadow Palette. And even if you're not a professional makeup artist, um, what I try to do is I try to get stuff that, if you're a professional or even if you're not a professional, um, these are things that you would use and hopefully like. So these are the two palettes I got. The second set I got is a little bit different and it's huge. And I can't open it because, um, as you can see, it's got wrapping and I don't want to take that off. That's, that's for whoever wins this to open. Um, but it's pretty much all of the sleek, oh not sleek, <laughs> sugar pill eyeshadows. The only one that isn't included in this set um, is bullet Bulletproof, which I've got here. But I'm not going to include it in this one, I'm going to com include it in another little set that I'll be giving away at another point. Um, so whenever I do this giveaway, it will just be this palette. And it's all the sugar pill eyeshadows, and they're really good. I think you've all heard me raving about how good they are. So I thought I'd get this palette to give away. The next thing I got is the Z palette and there were quite a few different designs um, and it was annoying because at first I was looking around and I just wanted to find a plain black one. Um, they had one which had a snakeskin pattern and then some which had polka dots um, but I thought it would be better to just get um, a Z palette which was plain because then um, it's something that whoever gets it is more likely to like it. I don't want to get something that someone will be like, ugh, I hate polka dots. Um, so I just got something plain and I was going to fill it up with eyeshadows but I thought Eyeshadows are such a personal thing and, and what colours you like are so personal. Um, I thought I would just leave it and then whoever wins can fill it up with their own eyeshadows. Um, but to add to it, I got three different blushes from Sleek. I got Rose Gold, um, Pixie Pink and Pomegranate. So that's what I'll be giving away in this set. The next thing I got is a brush set from Royal Langdicle. And I was thinking of getting the Silk Pro set. I think it was what I used. Um, it's the one with the cork case, and I really, really like that case, but um, not that case, that brush set. But the reason I ended up going for this is I thought that this one, um, even though it's the same price, it looks a lot flashier and it looks a lot nicer. Um, and I think the cork packaging for the other one might be a little bit off-putting, so I got the feeling that if I got this, it's something that people are more likely to enjoy, whoever wins it. Um, it's got a really lovely red case, but again, I can't open it because... Um, I want whoever wins that to open it, but the inside's got a lovely red material and the brushes are very pretty. And even though I don't use um, brush shampoo, it's the kind of thing that someone else would like very much, I think. And this one smells amazing and it's really good. It smells of lemon and I love the smell of lemon, so I thought it would make sense to include that one in this set. I thought it would be really nice to include a special effects makeup kit because a lot of you have asked me um, what's a kind of basic special effects makeup kit for if you're just getting into special effects so I thought it would be really nice to give away one of those as well. Um, originally this was a lot smaller, you could buy a small set like this at IMATS um, but I wanted to include a few things. Originally it just included the, um, the blood, uh, latex, um, the scar wax and a little thingamabob, oh yeah, and um, what's it called? Spirit gum. Um, but there were a few more things I wanted to include. What I ended up doing is um, I also included some removal um, because it doesn't make sense to have special effects makeup and then not include the remover so I added this to that set. I also included three different, um, what are they called, tooth colours and you've probably seen me use this in the zombie hag look um, but I thought whatever, um, whoever wins this is probably going to be into zombies and stuff like that so Hopefully they'll want to make their teeth look a little bit rotten and disgusting, so I included that in this set. Another thing I got are these two effect wheels. Um, this one would be really good for kind of bruises, cuts, burns, um, and this one would be more appropriate for kind of rotting, zombie, and um, that kind of stuff. So I added these to the kit as well. And then the last thing I added to this kit, um, I figured since you already had spirit gum included, it would make sense to include something that you could use that with. So I just got some basic um, kind of blood bullet wound things to include in that. So these are what I'll be giving away in this set. These I didn't get at iMats. Um, afterwards I was a little bit naughty and I popped into a super drug. 
I figured if I'm going to get away, get giveaway prizes, um, it would be nice to get quite a few of them at the same time. Um, and what I wanted to do is I wanted to put together a kind of lips themed um, set. So I got one of the, um, I think this pout paint, yes, from Sleek. Really, really good. It's, I think I compared it to the OCC Lip Tars a while back on my blog. Um, but that was ages ago, so the pictures are probably going to make me cringe. So I might need to re-review those at some point. But it's really good. Um, just a little bit, just the tiniest blob will quite literally cover half your face. It's incredibly pigmented. Um, and then I got three different lip shades from Anyway. I think you all know how much I love their lip shades. Um, I figured I'd get these three different colours because then even if you don't like one of them, hopefully there's at least one that you would like. Um, and then to go with it, I got three different lip liners. So that's another little set that I'll be giving away. And then the last set that I'll be giving away is um, an eyes theme set. And these um, are some of my favourite pairs of lashes currently. They look a little bit dishevelled and a bit crazy. But they look so pretty when you have them on. I got three of them for myself and they're so pretty. Um, and then I've also included Sugar Bulletproof. Uh, not Sugar Bulletproof. Sugar Pills Bulletproof Eyeshadow. And you all know how much I love that. Um, and then I've got the MUA um, is this Naked 2 palette and I reviewed this on my blog um, and previously the other MUA palettes I've tried I was a little bit disappointed with them because they were very chalky and dusty and I don't know what they've done but they've managed to sort out the formula I think um, with these eyeshadows and I was really really impressed with them and I loved them um, and I thought it would be really nice to include them because then you also have the Barry M um, eyeliners I got black, purple, gold, silver and bronze um, and I think it would be quite a nice combination because you have these neutral eyeshadows, um, the really beautiful black eyeshadow if you want to have a real punch to your makeup. Um, this one's okay but I've never found an eyeshadow which is as good as this one so it's nice to include it on that set. So you could do a really simple natural eye makeup look but then to give it a bit more oomph you could have like a purple or a gold eyeliner and I think it would look really nice. So. This is the last set that I'll be giving away. So that's all the stuff I got for future giveaways at IMATS. I hope you liked it. Um, I'm not sure when I'll be doing the giveaways, but what I'm hoping to do is have one once a month over the next few months. So if you've got that to look forward to, I um, hope you enjoyed it and I look forward to doing the giveaways.